Hey, what's up y'all, it's Tan from Convenient Keto, and today we are looking at Moon Tower Matcha. It's a ready to drink matcha drink. So Moon Tower Matcha is ready to drink, and it is completely unsweet. So it's great for keto and low carb. This is probably the most boring nutrition facts label you've ever seen. It zeroes down the board, pretty much like water, um, but there are zero carbs, which is what we were looking for. Ingredients, water, matcha, and some lactic acid as a preserver. And something we like to see, this Moon Tower Matcha is straight out of Austin, Texas. Real quick, just got a shout out to the ATX. Moon Tower Matcha is one of many companies that's coming out with low carb, uh, keto friendly products in the ATX area and we love it. Keep it coming. All right, let's dig in. Just tried some and it's not gonna surprise anyone. If you've ever had unsweetened matcha, that's what it tastes like. So uh, if you've ever had that amazing grass green superfood powder, it kind of tastes like that, right? Just, just unsweetened green stuff. If you're cool with that, yeah, it's great. It's ready to drink, you don't have to brew it, you can keep it refrigerated, and it's a nice little energy kick. But what we wanna do is do a little keto hack, kick it up a notch, and do a little recipe. We're just gonna take this amazing Rebel Vanilla Ice Cream, combine it with our matcha, and we're gonna do a little matcha float. In she goes. So I just had to basically use the entire pint of ice cream to fill up this glass uh, for photographic purposes, of course. Um, but luckily, this Rebel pint is only five gram net carbs for the entire thing. It's pretty crazy. I didn't want to overdo it on the matcha, so it didn't add a crazy amount. Uh, basically what you're ending up with is some, some green tea slash matcha ice cream. Look at that. Just tried some of this stuff and it is so good. Definitely don't need to add any additional sweetener. They complement perfectly. Man, if you're a fan of like anything green tea or matcha, like a lattes or ice cream, that's gonna be right up your alley. It's so good. If you're a drinker of unsweetened matcha tea, freshly brewed, you're gonna like this. Nice and convenient, right out of the box. Uh, but normally when you see stuff in like a Starbucks or anywhere else that you would buy like a something with matcha in it, it's gonna be probably like in a latte, right? So what we're gonna do is do a little almond milk. So almond milk is perfect for this type of thing. Um, it has a nice almondy nutty flavor. It has a little bit of grit to it, right? It's not like the smoothest thing. And um, this particular one is unsweetened vanilla. So we'll add a little bit of this with our Moon Tower Matcha and a little bit of Stevia and make ourselves a little latte. We're gonna do some better Stevia organic Stevia extract. Next is the matcha. Lastly, the almond milk. We're just gonna throw it right in the microwave. Be right back. And there you go, straight out of the microwave. See how frothy it gets? It's beautiful. That sweetener all combines with the matcha and it's such a great little mix again with almond milk. Seriously, look how frothy that gets. That's all you have to do, just throw it in the, the microwave for a couple minutes and it comes out just like that. So again, just some sweetener, some almond milk in this Moon Tower matcha, throw it in the microwave and you have this delicious latte. Wrapping up, Moon Tower Matcha out of Austin, Texas. Great, great, great stuff. Um, perfect for that little matcha ice cream hack that we did and also some almond matcha lattes. Um, go to drinkmoontower.com and they have an online shop there and you can pick some up. Lastly, I forgot to mention that that Rebel ice cream is also now available online. Go to rebelcreamery.com and pick some up. Thanks for watching. This is Ton with a Convenient Keto. I'm about to enjoy some matcha.